Yo, what's going on Animal Kingdom fans? What's going on? I'm back with another video review, alright? Now, this video review was requested, alright? So, I'm going to do my best to describe everything in the video review. And all you Animal Kingdom fans, make sure you subscribe to the channel for more content. Ring the bell, leave your theories, comment, and give me more feedback, alright? Now, let's get into this quick video review on... Animal Kingdom Season 6, Episode 8. The episode is titled Revelations, alright? Now here we go. The first description of the episode reads, Darren and Jay consider a small job, okay? Now, as you guys seen in the episode, that Darren was approached by his co-worker and his employee, Tommy. So Tommy, he works at Darren's establishment and also Tommy approached him with the idea for a job it's a it's a low dentist job you know um, the guy who he knows he collects a lot of gold silver coins and he was trying to get Darren's interest in the small town job because Darren and his crew his brothers they all are known for pulling off big big time heist jobs you know like you know like bringing in like millions and hundreds and thousands of dollars right but this small time job that Tommy approached Darren with was in the total amount of about fifty thousand dollars all right so Darren we all know is is you know pretty much putting off way more than that with him and his brothers so Tommy also wanted Darren to take him along on the job so he can see how Darren worked and so he can see how his crew move, you know what I'm saying, like that. So Darren considered it and he told him yes. And also we're seeing that the job didn't go so well. I mean they did get away with 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 the free boxes of fruit of the um you know small items or whatnot. And they also we also seen when Tommy got hurt as one of the one of the guys seen them breaking into the dentist establishment you know we seen that Tommy got hurt and we're seeing that Tommy was you know he was getting getting help by Jay you know Jay he seen Tommy was real hurt and you know decided to patch him up and uh, you know making sure he's good and if they decide to pull out another job you know it would be between Jay Darren Craig and Pope you know so if they have another job will they tag Tommy along with them or will they just you know leave him be so he can pull off the small time jobs you know you guys stay tuned on that because remember this is the last season all right you guys got five more episodes left in the season man we can't wait to see what the rest of the storyline is going to look like with the characters it's going down Animal Kingdom season eight revelations is going down Next description reads, Craig, Ren, and Nick spend the day to, together as a family. Okay, so we see that Nick has been rescued by his father, Craig. You know, um, Craig, he was so worried about Nick and Ren. And he really wanted to get his son back because we seen that Nick was, was kidnapped by a white supremacist who Ren knew. Okay, so this has something to do with Ren, and uh, we seen that Nick he's back safe and sound. His his father he wasn't giving up without a fight. You know, Craig he was he was over the edge. He was at the boiling point. You know, he just wanted to rip somebody's head off. You know, he went to his brother. You know, Darren he asked him where are the guns. He told Darren the truth that Nick was kidnapped, and Darren told him calm down. We're gonna get him back. So without hesitation. Darren, he rode with Craig, even though him and Craig had a little scuffle in episode seven, all right? You know, at the family house, they had a little scuffle, but, you know, the, you know, Craig and Darren, they've been having issues and scuffles ever since they were like six, seven years old, right? So they've been doing this since they were children, you know? So as you've seen in flashbacks. So, without hesitation, Craig and Darren, hey, they went and they met somebody else who knew the white supremacist, all right? And they went to where he was, and man, they rushed in, and hey, they took care of business, as usual. You know, those guys are soldiers, you know, they're going in, 
and they're gonna you know risk it all they went in they rescued Nick got him back safe and sound and the white supremacist told him that it's not over with but when Craig had the shotgun in his face and he blew his head off so Craig knew right then that it was over with because you kidnapped my son I was over with right now so Craig let him have it and that was the end of that but will that really be the end of it because you know I'm pretty sure he has backup the white supremacy has other brothers he has backup and when they find him do you think they're gonna retaliate on Craig and Ren you guys better stay tuned last episodes of season 6 Animal Kingdom is going down you guys don't want to miss it next description reads Pope senses something is off now Pope when Pope came home to the family house when he looked up at the cereal box he knew that something was very off then because as you guys see all of the cereal boxes were faced toward the front of each other like all the labels were faced front front and center you know you can see all the labels but when he seen one of the boxes were turned around one of the labels wasn't wasn't appeared of the front as all the other labels were to to be seen right so right then you know that Pope knew something was out then all right so he took the cereal boxes down he opened up all the packages and you know he was trying to find out what was going on and also he had a monitor device all right so he had the monitor device and he was going all around the house and the monitor device can pick up any like cameras you know uh, any kind of technology monitors that's you know around the house like the monitor device can pick up that it can sense it all around the house probably within a um, two mile radius or you know just anywhere you know square feet mile within the house right so once again Pope knew something was really wrong so also he reviewed the, the video footage um, on the camera around the house because you know they do have surveillance around the house and he reviewed the footage and he could see that you know when he looked at the uh, security gate the security gate was open and it was closing so he knew something right then was off because he barely seen anyone coming in or out but he knew somebody was coming in because he seen the gate open and close right now that's a very very suspicion right there so he went to the skating board and he approached Taylor and he asked Taylor I met your mom right so Taylor hey he knew kind of Taylor he knew Taylor was lying because when he asked Taylor what did his mom do for a living once again Pope he 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 knew something was really really off so he got the truth out of Taylor and Taylor told him that she was a cop and she wanted all the dirt on Pope all right so when Taylor confessed this to Pope this made Pope upset oh man Pope was about to just you know rip Taylor's head off because you know Taylor also told him that she wanted me to get in your house you know so Pope knew that you know with that info right there he knew that that was the person who was in his house and he knew that she turned the cereal box around and she was on the camera footage oh yeah so Pope he found all of this out by Taylor and Taylor and also he wanted Taylor to call to call him so they can meet because you know Pope had an idea and we all seen that idea how it went down you know he hired his boy to get more info on her you know also you know uh, Pope wanted to get his uh, wrench so he can you know mess with her tra transmission and also you know Pope wanted to get her alone so you know he knew where the hotel was and also when he got inside the hotel he wanted to have some words with her one on one and we all seen how that went down all right yo you guys stay tuned because next week's episode uh man it's going down last description reads Andrew fans out about Julia so we seen that Julia have been getting real close to bass all right now this 
was back in like 92, 93, all right? Back, this is this was in the flashback days uh, when Julia and Baz were, when they were teenagers. So, Julia and Baz, you know, they had sexual relations, you know, they had sex. Um, also, you seen that, you seen that Andrew walked in on Julia. And when he walked in on Julia, we, he walked in on Julia giving Bass a fellatio, all right? And when he seen this, he witnessed this with his own eyes. He was, you know, really blown off. So, I mean, he ran out. He was, he was, he was very upset that seeing his sister giving, you know, a sexual relation to a guy, man, that can, you know, make any one of the siblings, like, you know, just, you know, very upset, very frustrated, and really, really, you know, don't know what to do. So, we all know Pope, he loves to, like, you know, he loves to run out and deal with his own problems and deal with his own issues and deal with his and deal with his own issues. So, after that, Smurf, she wanted to know what was going on. So, Julia told Smurf to back off and she was going to deal with Andrew because she loves Andrew. That's her twin brother. And she wanted to find him because she loves him. And, you know, she just wanted to make it right and make amends with Andrew. So we will see how that will go in the next episode. All right. You guys stay tuned for more. Thank you guys for tuning in for the video review on Animal Kingdom Season 6, Episode 8, titled Relations, Revelations. Make sure you guys tune in, subscribe to the channel. If you want to know more, leave me your theories, comments, feedback, and I'll give you more content coming soon, all right? It's your boy. I'm out. Peace.